Jackson JS Free to T King V. As you may know from the thumbnail, I will sell this guitar next week. I bought it on Reverb in uh, 2020. It was my second uh, V-shape uh, guitar. The first was uh, an uh, Hammer. It was a Gibson copy, so the edges was rounded. And uh, I always want a King V like uh, Mustaine, like uh, Wes Borland, and like James, where uh, he writes on uh, the headstock uh, Kill Bon Jovi was very uh, affordable uh, really really good looking classic Jackson headstock shark tooth inlays freeway switch volume tone uh, Jackson unbuckers tunomatic bridge string through yeah I put a funny sticker on it so yeah 24 frets speed Jackson neck compound radius uh, the tuner are okay are Jackson tuners they stay in tune pretty well it's a bolt-on and that's one of the main reason why I sell it the body is popular the um, fingerboard is amaranth uh, maple for the neck but Anyway, the reason why I will sell this guitar. I love Jackson's, I love the headstock, I love the inlays, I love the concept. Uh, of course, uh, Jackson's are used by uh, my favorite band. So, I will definitely take another Jackson, but not with the same shape. I want to buy a Jackson Kelly or a Warrior. I am uh, uh, between uh, these two models. Because in my opinion, the King V is a great guitar if you play standing up. I only play guitar sitting down because you know. Boom. I have a little space here. My table, my computer, all the other guitar, lights, LED and all this kind of stuff. I can play standing up. So of course I can play like that. I have to put the guitar between my legs. So I have to squeeze my legs and uh, you are already uncomfortable, okay? So it stays uh, in this position, and this position is not so comfortable because uh, my arm is too far away from my body, and this arm is too far to the left. So it's okay when you play there, but if you play a metal song, you play uh, almost the 80% of rhythm, right? So, okay, I, I feel tension and pain already in this position, so I have to raise my left uh, leg, so footstool. Footstool, in uh, this position, it's pretty okay. The right hand is in the right position. The left hand is still too far away, in my opinion. So, see the angle. And the reason is really simple because there's space from your chest and the guitar. On a strut shaped guitar, on a Les Paul SG shaped guitar, you can rest the body of the guitar on your uh, uh, chest and let's give you some support. In this case, this is the distance from the body and my chest. So I have to play not here, but here. If I want to solve the problem, I have to put the guitar on my stomach. And in this way, the guitar is not straight, is inclined. So it's not so comfortable and this edge sticks directly on your, on your calf, okay? Boom! And it hurts when you are playing fast, you press on the neck, you feel pain on your calf. Ouch! So this is the main reason why I sell it, and the second reason is because I have to squeeze my um, leg constantly, I can't do that, okay? So I'm not uh, relaxed, I am 
constantly holding my legs and my uh, abdominals. After uh, 10 minutes you are tired, okay? And the third reason is uh, the uh, access on the last frets, you know? It's a big guitar, so you haven't wood over there, okay? Really, really accessible, right? No, it's not, because uh, it's uh, bolt on. So when I goes down on the neck, my thumb stops here. Okay. Here. And uh, my my hand is forced to do this thing to grip in this way. And it's really uncomfortable. I can barely play something. I have to switch the position of the thumb, not over here but in the upside and then I can but the position of the thumb is so unnatural so if I have to do a bending maybe on the 22 or 24 fret I have my thumb here and my ring finger here so that's the curve okay it's so big it's so stretch I feel pain over there so so yeah the V it's not for for everybody if you get a V I suggest you to get the, the neck through version and not the bolt on version and if you play in that standing up all the time maybe it's okay this probably will remains but so it's pretty okay if you are only a rhythm guitar player and playing standing up but if you are like me and you play only in your little tiny studio uh, recording guitars for hours, uh, uh, exercise, uh, teaching, playing uh, and all this kind of stuff the V it's not for you so that's the main reasons why I will sell this guitar next week and I will get a Jackson Kelly or a Jackson Warrior maybe in the comments if you have some experience with those models uh, let me know what are your impressions so hope this video can be useful for you it can help you uh, decide your next Jacksons or your next uh, uh, guitar and you are wondering if you will love a shape V uh, guitar or not give me a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video take care